Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm gonna have to time this. Wait for this one. Okay. All right, we gotta go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Okay, don't get washed overboard. Don't get washed overboard. Uh-oh. Uh oh Oh, no. Oh, and let's uh, pull it up. Pull it up. Oh, now I think we're going down. Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks. And yes, folks, we're back once again. And today, I've got a couple things planned for you guys. Now, last episode, I asked you guys what you wanted to see next, and it was pretty overwhelming between plane crash and ship survival. Now, I want to go ahead and say that we're not going to do that every episode. I do like to take these creations out and check them out and go do some missions. Uh, but right now, the game's been updating a lot, and I notice it's kind of unstable at the moment. And I've had some crashes uh, during missions, and I can tell you, that is really frustrating when it happens. So today, we are going to be attempting two things. I've got a plane set up for a plane crash survival, which this is something you guys wanted to see. Uh, we changed it up this time. Last time we did it, the plane just crashed, and it kind of floated there. I'm actually going to uh, do the same method I used to sink ships to the plane and hopefully we'll get it down to the bottom of the ocean. I'm not really sure if it's going to work or not. And number two, I have a new creation that I want to check out, so I'll probably check it out. We might try to complete a mission with it, and then of course, I think we'll probably sink it because it does have a lifeboat. And a lot of you guys want to see me try to actually use a lifeboat to escape. So. All the creations will be linked down in the description if you want to check out anything that you see in this episode. If you have any suggestions for Stormworks, comment below. And if you're enjoying Stormworks on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel, and let's do this. Alright, so we're going to start off with this small passenger plane. This is the AT-30, or the Air Taxi. Uh, this is a cool little plane. I don't, actually, you don't really see that many uh, passenger planes in Stormworks. A lot of times it's uh, big cargo planes, which... Pretty sure somebody's going to ask me to try one of those. Uh, the thing that scares me about the cargo planes is the whole fact that the uh, the back compartment, like the actual doors, never seal, it seems like. There's always cracks. So I believe this thing is completely sealed and ready to go here. I got our passengers. We're going to be flying a little bit of a rough weather here today. Let's go and let that down. Does this door close here? Uh, oh, I think it does, actually. Yeah. Oh, we can seal the, uh, I didn't know we could seal that off. Alright, so, got our passengers loaded up here. You got all your little amenities here. They've got their lights. A uh, pretty cool setup. I'd actually like to, uh, get this one out in multiplayer. Which, by the way, multiplayer, uh, we're talking about it a little bit. Uh, we're just kind of waiting for some updates to let the game get a bit better for multiplayer. Because right now it's, uh, a little bit wonky. Okay, so we are ready to go here. Now, a neat little feature about this plane is the whole fact of you can actually switch controls over to the co-pilot. So I wonder if that would seamlessly uh, actually switch over in multiplayer. So say if somebody's sitting in that seat and I can just go boom, and it would actually give them control. I don't know. Uh, let's go in cockpit lights, get those on. It's got an autopilot here. Uh, let's go and get our... Uh, oh, actually, I want to keep those up. Let's get the landing lights on. Got our brakes enabled right now. Let's go ahead and get everything there. Oh, it's got a fastened seatbelt sign. Okay. Let's go ahead and turn that on. Oh, it actually does a little ding. Ah, uh, it's satisfying. I right, gotta tell all the passengers to fasten their seatbelts. Uh, let's go ahead and warm up the engines here. Okay, so this has got a... You know, maybe we haven't tried this one out. I don't remember one with a throttle lever like this. Uh, does this one have any... Uh, no, it doesn't have hotkeys. Oh, this one's a loud, loud, loud airplane. Alright, engines are warmed up here. We're going to release the brake. Uh, we're just going to taxi out. Uh, there is another island somewhere that has a bigger runway on it. I'd like to actually see that. See, those are all... Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead and ease... Uh, get the engines powered up a little bit. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This one's a... Uh, this isn't on the... Uh, ooh, that has got a lot of power. Wow. All right, pulling out. Got a little bit of rough weather here today, but we should be good to go. All right, we're lined up with the runway here. We got our brakes applied. Let's go ahead and throttle up. Okay, release some brakes. All right, here we go. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Lift. Oh, we were a little sideways on takeoff there, but we did it. Oh, geez, this thing's fast. All right. It's a little bit of a rough takeoff, but... It wasn't too bad. 
Guess we're okay here. All right, let's get this thing up in the air. The wind has already got us a bit sideways here. I'm gonna get that, those landing gears up. Let's see, landing light, landing gear, there we go. Okay. Oh yeah, this is perfectly fine. Let's, uh, let's just climb here. Uh, we'll level off and we should be good to go. Uh, you can see the power plant to the left. I still have yet to see the mega island that's in this update. Maybe we'll pass over it. Uh, there's one of the, uh, what is that? Oh, there's the big, uh, landing strip out there. I can see that. I can see what appears to be another oil rig. I don't know if that's the new one or the old one. And, oh, there's a big island right there. Is that the mega island? Oh, I think it is. Is it? Hold on, let's, uh, we're gonna do a little bit of a, let's get in the first person here. Let's go autopilot. Oh, does that level itself out? It's feels like it's trying to. Dude, that's the Mega Island. Oh, jeez, that thing is huge. Is that a volcano? It kind of looks like a quarry or something. Dude, that is awesome. We'll have to explore that one day. At least we know we have it on this map. And it's really close to a spawn, so that's good to know. Uh, we are flying through the clouds right now. Rain's pretty rough here, but got the autopilot engaged. We are good to go. All right, we got all our lights on here. Yep, looks good there. Landing gear is up. Oh boy, that yeah, storm's getting a little rough here. Let's go. Uh, let's go converse with the passengers. We'll go ahead and give the controls to our uh, co-pilot. Oh, that looks a little bit insane. Everything's rocking around. You're seeing the lights flashing off the plane. It's dark. Might catch some lightning here. What would it be like to be a passenger on this? Oh, where's the water? Oh, there it is. Oh, it's just rocking. I would not feel very comfortable here. Yeah, we need to do this in multiplayer. We'll load some people down here in the back. Oh, this thing is starting to climb. What is the autopilot doing? Yeah, our altitude's going up. Oh, let's close this. Yeah, our altitude's climbing here. Our airspeed's kind of the same. Let's turn off autopilot here. We're looking good. Okay, let's go ahead and get out. Oh, we are really, really high up in the air right now. Oh, geez. Yeah, let's try to level this off real quick. Now, the worst case scenario that I can think of is if we lose engine power. Here, this high, we'll have to go into an emergency landing. And right now, we're over open ocean. Like, there is no land in sight. I don't know where the islands are compared to this. Uh, no more have generated out. Uh, all right, folks, it's getting a little dark. The, uh, we're experiencing quite a bit of turbulence here. We're going to go ahead and... Oh, this thing is... Oh, this thing's banking really hard. Oh, yeah, this is bad. Okay, we need to go... I want to put the wind to the back of the, uh, back of the plane here. We're going to turn around and start heading back towards land. Uh, because this is not safe conditions-wise to, uh, to be flying in. Alright, looking for an island here. I think there's an island over there. Yeah, it looks like there might be a landmass over there. So, alright, we, we're good, I, I think. Uh, we had, a uh, on engines just shut off. Let's just try to refire them here. See if we can catch it. Come on. There we go. They fired back up. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, uh oh uh oh on. Let's, uh, pull it up. Pull it up. Oh, pull up! No, I think we're going down. Oh, come on, pull up! Oh, once this thing gets into a death sprawl. Oh, and actually, we might be able to point the nose up here. Come on, point up, point up! No, oh, the wind's shoving me! Uh, pull up, pull up, pull up! Uh, oh, this is gonna be a collision with the water. Oh, is there any land nearby? On, oh, pull up! Oh! Oh! Oh, oh geez! Uh oh. Alright. All right, we're in the water. Okay, we got a little bit of time here. Uh, let's go ahead. Unfasten seatbelts. Oh, buddy. Up. Oh. All right, it just went dark. Hold on. Okay, let's get the lights on. We got to go back here. And, oh, there is water in here, isn't there? Uh-oh. Uh, the back portion of the plane is filling with water at the current moment. Oh, there's water in here. Hold on. Oh, this is working. Okay, I did not. I wasn't sure if this was gonna work. Hold on, let's see if we can fire. Okay, no, we're screwed. Okay, we need to get out of here. Uh, let's see. Let's go. Open the doors. Try to evacuate passengers. Uh, see, water keeps coming up and going down. Yeah, it's definitely filling though. Oh, it just filled. Okay, we're still uh, we're still bobbing. Would this be our only emergency exits? The side ones? I guess so. Oh, you can see it. The back end's taking on. Oh, it's going under. 
Yeah, this thing's working. The other one was completely out of water for a long time. All right. Uh, do we need to bust open the sides and get out of here? Let's go ahead and go open. Ooh. Oh, this would stink. Oh, there we go. I want to see if we can get up on top of whatever we have left here. I think some of the waves are still keeping some of this afloat here. My question is, is that door being open actually? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Ooh. I don't know if that door being open affects it or not, to be honest with you. Oh, buddy. Okay, where's the nearest... Hold on, what is that? Wait, what is that? That's got to be an island over there. I do believe more and more of my airplane is disappearing. All right, that's a landmass. Where do we end up? I know we got turned around. What island is that? That looks like a refinery or something. There's our, our home bases down here. So, yeah, we definitely got turned around. We actually went all the way up here and came back down, which is really odd. All right. So, question is, it's like it is filling, but it's like it's found its happy point. Like, it's staying, uh, it's not nearly uh, as bad as the last one. The other one just floated completely on the water, but this one, uh, the nose seems to be uh, kind of staying up here. So, I'm not sure if it's going to go all the way down or not. Uh, but it is rigged to uh, sink. But planes might be just that weird item that are harder uh, harder to sink than the boats for some reason. That is still a very, very scary feeling to be stuck out here with this thing potentially going down and being in a big, oh, being in a big uh, storm like that. That is scary. So, obviously there's water getting out somewhere. It's like the plane can't be sealed off. Maybe it's the door. Uh, because it is wired to basically sink, so obviously that's not working with this at the moment. I'll have to figure these out a little bit more. If you guys have any suggestions for the plane uh, crash uh, survival, let me know down in the comments below. But let's go check out that ship. Alright, so the creator of this is Cruise Missile. Uh, they made uh, quite a few really cool ships. Uh, this is a USCG Sentinel class cutter. And it comes with the Ugly Duckling, which is its little uh, little lifeboat. So let's go ahead and spawn this real quick. Boom, there it is. Oh, that is a beautiful ship. Not too big, so I really do think we'll be able to escape this uh, fairly easy. Now, a lot of these smaller ships do sink fairly fast too, so I'll have to be careful. Uh, let's get into this and check it out real quick. There's the crane for the, uh, ooh, how does this work? Okay, so there's the hoist, so we can get it up and down and that. Oh, that's how that works. So this is going to completely lift this out of the water. Does it pick it up? Oh, this is going to... I guess you park the uh, the lifeboat right outside the ship. Now, we got to keep it in mind, if this thing's going down, we're going to have to maybe try to hoist it out first uh, before we actually try to uh, get in the boat. All right. I love these Coast Guard cutters. Let's check out the crew cabin real quick. What do we got in here? Medical. Looks like a medic bay through here. There's uh, got to be some lights here somewhere. There we go. So you got medic bay, crew quarters, got some lockers and stuff back here. Pretty awesome inside. Uh, how do we get up to the the next deck? Is there... Okay, there's a ladder over here. Here we go. Alright, so let's get into this one real quick. Here's the bridge. Let's go ahead and get into here. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and pull this out a bit. That way we can get the, uh, get the little lifeboat on. Alright, let's go ahead. Signal that we're getting ready to go here. So engine starts, nav lights are on, let's turn our deck lights on, let's throttle this one up, there we go. Yeah, a lot of people, I've noticed, been putting these uh, these throttle levers on here like this. It used to be a lot of people would put it uh, connected to the W and the S key, but now I guess a lot of people figured instead of having cruise control, you can have these set up like uh, kind of like on a little lever and button here, and as soon as you click it, it's going to stay at the, uh, the set throttle. And I guess that eliminates the need for cruise control. All right. Oh, we turned on that rear flood lamp. That looks cool. There's something here on the front I want to check out real quick. What is this? Is this maybe a searchlight? No, I believe actually yeah, these are the water pumps. This does have uh, firefighting capabilities on it too. It's got two pumps here in the front. Uh, that is pretty awesome. All right, let's go get the lifeboat. All right, there's our savior. This is the Ugly Duckling. <laughs> That's kind of a fun name for a, a lifeboat. Uh-oh. Is there already water in this lifeboat? Uh, that's kind of scary. Alright. Oh, it's got a magnet. Okay, that's to attach to the top. Okay, so let's go ahead and start this thing up. Hop into it here. 
All right, folks, question is, are we going to actually be able to get off into the lifeboat and escape the ship? Will this be a first for us? So I've got the magnets on, and then we're going to pull up and get under them the way we should be. There we go. A little bit more, a little bit more. There. That should probably grab them right now. There we go. So one thing that Stormworks has added, which I think is a really, really cool feature, uh, we have a mission selector now. All right, so we go to missions here, and you see the down helicopter. Well, they recently added the mission selector, so you can click into this. Uh, you've got your workshop missions, which I haven't downloaded anything yet. Uh, you've got your own saved missions, which we can do this at some point. I, I really do want to create some stuff. Kind of curious if we could do something with the sinking ship survival in a mission. I'm not really sure. And then you can go to the official ones here, which you have the brilliant fuels, oil, which that was the one we did last time with the rig emergency. But you can see all the other ones they have here, like uh, transferring crew. Uh, looks like there's one for a uh, towing the tanker. Let's see over here, you got the research center. It's uh, the retrieve the drones. You got the medic vac uh, ones where you medevac the workers from the oil rigs. Or you've got the ones where you do it from the actual tanker. That's pretty cool. Uh, C4, that's a new set of missions. You've got the uh, C4 generator fire and the stranded terrorist. What if we took some people down with us? Would that be kind of mean to go pick up some people, then sink the ship? Maybe we should do that. Yeah, we're going to pick up these stranded terrorists real quick. There we go, stranded terrorists. Let's go ahead and mark it here. Plus, we'll get to see the new C4. Where is this bad boy? Oh, jeez! That thing is nine kilometers out that way. That's all the way across the map. And they want you to take him to the, uh, oh, the tourist over here. Oh, never mind, the sea fort's right here. I was like, man, that's ridiculous. All right, so we're going to set this up, folks. We are going to pick up some tourists. We're going to have them aboard. And we're going to see if we can save maybe some of them as this thing goes down. Maybe load them up, try to get them in the lifeboat. Might lose a couple, I'm not really sure. What is that? Oh, that's the uh, other, I don't know if that's a new island or not. That's got a really big airstrip island. Very cool. Dude, this looks like one of those old forts. That is cool. This is something we haven't seen before. Is there a dock on here? Please tell me there is a dock or something here. We don't have to go up in the fort. I didn't bring a helicopter today, folks. Let's uh, hope that we can go on the other side of it. All right, here we are. This feels slightly cool if there isn't a dock over here. Oh, there it is. Okay, sweet. This is a pretty cool island. I wonder what's on the inside of this. We might take a, a quick peek inside, too. Uh, we're going to be a tourist ourselves. Right, let's climb the stairs. Let's say hello to my people. There is five of them up here. Hello. Oh, geez, you guys do look like tourists. What are you wearing on your head? Okay, you guys stay here. I mean, can we can we open this? Oh, we can. Dude. Dude, this is cool. How would you... This kind of reminds me of uh, Fallout 4. There was a little... uh little fort. I don't think it was actually on the island. It was just on the coast. It reminds me of that a lot. This is a cool island. Look at the old cannons and stuff. I just want to live here. Hold on. What's in the main building? Uh, What the heck? We can go all the way up here. Anything of interest up here? Kind of hoping they start adding some Easter eggs soon. Maybe we'll get something Uh, maybe on this fort. I always picture there being like sharks or like there's a large kraken or something out in the water. That would be awesome. All right, people, we are totally going to save you guys today. You are smart. You've already got your life jacket on. Good job. All right, let's get in the water, and let's get aboard the boat, and we're totally not going to sink. There appears to be a tourist who has fallen into the stairs. You know what? We're going to be a tourist short here. Come on. Come on, guide. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, you are not very good at being a guide. You've already lost somebody due to the stairs. Oh, well. Alright everybody, welcome aboard the USS Komodo. Nothing uh, bad totally happens here. I do want to apologize about your friend that's stuck in the stairs over there. Uh, there's nothing I can do about that. You uh, people feel free to make yourselves at home. Please stop following me. You just sit on deck. Stop following and stop following. Alright, uh, mingle. Do fun things. Uh, let's get moving here. Alright, so we're going to head towards the objective. We're just never going to make it to it. Alright, so we are cruising to our destination. Our destination is only 8.7 kilometers out. Uh, I had to put everybody inside. Everybody, as soon as I hit the throttle on the ship, they started to slide. And I was like, we're going to lose all of the tourists before we even sink the ship. So, that's not good. Now, this ship is cutting through these waves. 
but it does seem to have a bit of a lean to it. Like, this thing leans out to the right, and I don't know if it's just the way we're hitting the, the waves or what the heck's going on there. Oh, when the boats are rocking, don't come knocking. Wow, this thing is, uh, this is doing it, though. I like these, uh, kind of skinnier ships. They rock a lot, but man, they just cut right through the waves. This is fantastic looking. Uh, one thing I, wait, what is that? Is that the, hold on, what island is that? Is that the Mega Island? Hold on, let's check our map. No, that's, that can't be it. No, the Mega Island's definitely bigger than that. Yeah, for a second there, I was like, oh man, we almost have to go discover that. That's a new island, but the Mega Island is, well, it's mega. It's really, really huge. So, what are we, about 5.5 .5 kilometers out? All right, we're doing good here, folks. Uh, making good time. The tourists are happy to be off the fort. Uh, they're not going to be happy too much longer, though. All right, everything seems to be good. We're kind of cutting in between the waves. We probably should be going against them or with them here. Oh, that was a lean there. Oh, we got broadsided there for a second by that wave. Wow. That was cool. Man, these, uh, these waves, once you get into open water, they're just killer. Absolutely killer waves. Look at that. That is so glorious. All right. Uh, we're going to get hit pretty hard here. Oh, look at it jump. I don't know how the tourists are faring in there. Maybe we should go check on them here. Oh, let's get down on the deck. Let's try not to fly off this. Man, what other game gives you a view like that? Like, seeing these waves crash around the ship. Like, it's just... The experience is like no other. Uh, let's check everybody here. Oh. <laughs> oh everybody just hit the ceiling. Oh, everybody do the wave. Oh, boy. Uh, you guys look okay. Uh, they're all huddled around the front, probably terrified. Uh, let's get back to the back. Stay close to the side here. All right. Let's get back up to uh, our spot. Uh, does the boat seem to be leaning in the back a bit? Oh! <laughs> dude. Wait, dude. Wait. No, 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 no. Are we already sinking? Uh, no. I think you're just getting hit by those waves. You know, during all that talking, I just now noticed... There it is. There it is. That's got to be it there. That's the mythical Mega Island. What the heck? Oh, look how big it is. Okay, the island that we passed by earlier was back there. The one I thought might have been it. Hold on, let's check it out on the map. Oh, that's definitely it right there. The Mega Island. Wow, we'll have to actually explore that one day. It looks like there's ruins and stuff on it. Oh, that's so cool. That is way too cool. All right, let's check. Uh, oh, yeah, we're sinking. Oh, look at the bottom of the... Uh oh This is going to be awkward here. We're going to have to prepare this really soon. Yeah, because that water line uh, should be about where the red is when we're in stable... Well, it's not really stable, but in between waves, and you can see it'll go down below that. Uh, oh, yeah, like right there. Oh, man. Thankfully, this has some uh, some decent guardrails on it. Oh, we're going to get hit real hard here. All right, we've got a... I think we've got an emergency on our hands here. All right, probably going to radio into the Coast Guard that uh, appears we are taking on water. Our, uh, looks like our salvation might actually be the Mega Island, so we're going to keep the engines cranked to try to keep up the nose. We're going to slow it down a bit before we abandon ship here. Let's go ahead and... Push that signal horn, let everybody know. Hopefully somebody's paying attention on the Mega Island. And, oh, it's a big wave right there. Okay, we're good. I can see the tour guide and all that bouncing. We're still good. All right, we need to load the people up. This is going to be pretty tough on this deck because uh, of the water spilling over it right now. Oh, I don't think I can go below. Oh, can I go down to that deck? Oh, look at this. Here comes another one. Oh, geez. Okay, I'm going to have to time this. Wait for this one. Okay. All right, we gotta go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Okay, don't get washed overboard. Don't get washed overboard. Don't get washed overboard. Get in here. Get in here. Crew cabin. All right, everybody. We got ourselves an emergency situation. I want everybody to uh, maybe remain calm because I don't know if I'm going to. Uh, we're getting hit by uh, waves here really bad, so everybody needs to follow me. What's the best way to go out here? <laughs> oh, definitely not that way. All right, let's go and open the door. We gotta time this to get to the life. Uh, boat. Oh, we're underwater. Wait, are we underwater? Okay, here we go. Come on, everybody. Let's run. Run, 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 run. Okay. No. Stay against the... Okay. Ooh. Oh. Okay, I'm going to pick you up. 
Okay, get inside. Get get inside. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh, we gotta release this. Okay, get inside. Okay. Oh, we're going down. Okay, we gotta. Okay, let's release the boat. Release the boat. Oh, come on, come back up. Come back up. Oh, we're getting thrown around. This is violent. Come on, come on, boat. No. No, it's capsizing right now. No, we're not losing this. We're not losing the fight here. Magnets released. Oh, oh, it just capsized. No, no, we're not going out this way. Okay, it's fleeing back over. All right, oh, we gotta get to the life raft. Oh, it's stuck, it's jammed. Oh, it's going down, come on. Okay, crane out. Oh, okay, I gotta go back up. Hopefully that will release uh, the life raft. Come on, I'm in the life raft. Okay, oh man, oh, oh man. Oh, it's going up. Oh, it's floating to the top. Oh, we actually might make this, folks. Oh, we gotta break through. Oh, I don't know how that guy's sitting there. And, oh, yes. Uh oh. No, no, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? No, it capsized. Oh, come on, come on. Stay, stay up, stay afloat. No. <laughs> oh, we're getting tossed around so bad right now. All right, this is not a good strategy. Uh, definitely not. Where's the boat at? Okay, we made it that far away from the boat. All right. Oh, buddy. Let's see if we can get up here. Uh, oh, we might lose the one guy. I, yeah, I got to be able to get to him. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're going down. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Here we go. All right, we just got to pick up the guy. Come on. There we go. We got him. All right, let's just drop him. All right, let's get to the surface here. Ooh, we're riding waves right now. Oh, jeez. I'm going to try to get to the other people. Uh, it would be nice to be able to get to them, and maybe we can make our way to the island. There'd be no way we'd be able to make it out here, though. Uh, maybe at the life jacket for a little bit, but... Man, these waves would just drag you under. Come on, tourist! Here we go. Got you. Follow me. I hope everybody's following. You've got one chance to make it out of this. Follow me. All right, let's head to the island and see if we can make it to the mega island. Oh, uh, how many people are actually with me right now? Wait, are they? I think they're attempting to follow me, but they can't keep up. Oh, I think we just lost all the tourists. All right, well, it's every man for themselves. If we can get up to this island, which we're riding waves right now, and this is actually kind of helping us move fairly fast, uh, we might be able to get to the mega island. Here we go, and I think... I think we're, I think we're ashore here. Oh, there we go. Oh, let's get out of here for another big wave hits us. Sorry, tourist. <laughs> you're kind of, you're kind of out of options here. Oh, let's climb up on this. Wow. Some deadly seas out there. And here we are. This is the, uh, this is the mega island. Oh, we made it. Oh boy. We made it. Nobody else did. I kind of apologize about that. Oh boy. Well, here we are at the Mega Island. But anyways, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Stormworks. Uh, this was a pretty fun little episode here. We did a little bit of everything. Uh, attempted a mission, even though I knew, uh, I knew we weren't going to complete that. Because it's really just a delivery mission. But it was pretty, uh, pretty cool to see the Mega Island here. And the fort. We'll probably do a Mega Island tour at some point. See if there's anything actually uh, worth it up here. But uh, if you guys have any uh, other suggestions for things you want to see in Stormworks, let me know down in the comment section below. Any ideas, uh, missions, maybe even uh, look at maybe the custom mission editor next. I'm not really sure. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for all the love and support on this series. And we will see you guys next time in Stormworks.